Hey, what's going on guys? It's your boy Toasty and today we are taking on the Demon Chimera. Uh, so here's the party right now. We're going to use uh, CG Phoenix because she's awesome. We're also going to use Lunera. She's going to be able to buff the whole party. So she's just going to sing for the whole fight. Mr. Warrior of Light here is going to be our Provoke tank. Uh, he's going to try to cover as much damage as he can. And I also gave him a Ring of Lucy because we're going to try to kill him with magic. And since Alterna takes forever to cast, hopefully we're going to be able to kill it. And if you guys have Explorer Eileen, trust me, she makes that fight so much easier. So I'm just going to show you guys what I have on her. Fixed Dice, Pretty Sharp, Brilliant Clouds Uniform, Double Martial Glove. And right here we got uh, Pouches for the killer abilities for Beast because Demon Chimera is a beast. Tomb Raider and Mog Wisdom to try to fill that limit burst a little bit faster and without further ado let's get going into the fight guys uh, make sure if you are doing that fight don't bring any fire weapon, ice weapon, thunder weapon, light weapon or dark weapon since he's 300% able to boost himself against uh, those elements you can sleep him for 20% max chance to sleep but if you do physical attacks to him it's gonna wake him up he does a lot of fire, ice, lightning damage and also a lot of magic damage. And be careful because sometimes he's going to be able to buff himself up, if I'm not mistaken, by 300% for his attack and magic. You're going to be able to break his defense and spirit, but not his attack and magic. So, without with me saying all of these things right here, we're going to go down right now. Uh, what should we do on the first turn? I think we're just going to... Take no chance, cover for the whole party. Lunar is just gonna sing for the party. Right here, Lotus Mage Fina. Mm, I think we're gonna go dual, uh, not dual cast, we're just gonna cast Divine Veil. I love this ability. Just basically making sure we're not gonna take any magic damage by all those elements. And right here, you guys can see she is really, really powerful. Uh, he's gonna poison us. I don't think it's going to be that bad, we should, we should be able to survive that, no problem. Where of Light just jumps in front of everything. There you go, no biggie, no biggie, we're still surviving. Uh, yeah, basically he's not taking any light damage because of the uh, Ring of Lucy right here. So, uh, dual cast, my friend, we're not going to waste any time now. We're going to go Isunaga and... Uh... <laughs> I think we're just gonna cast a Karaja, just to make sure everybody's up and running. Explore Eileen, you know what you're gonna do. Uh, basically now we're gonna pass his threshold, so at, he's gonna cast a uh, War, which is gonna buff all uh, his attack and magic by 300%. But we're gonna try to do a little bit more damage, since we're gonna break his defense by 45%. And let's see if we can bring him down to, let's say, maybe 50? 50%? Can we get him to 50%? 57! Strong enough. We should be good. There you go. Ring of Lucy just going on. Making sure that he evades. Make sure that he evades some attack here. Uh, now, we have to be careful because you guys can see right here. He just buffed his attack and magic and we don't want that because he's going to do a lot of damage. So, without waiting, we're going to use dual cast. If you don't have a CG Fina, but you have any type of other healer, just make sure that you use this spell at this moment or else you're going to be in a lot of trouble and just to be sure I'm just going to cast a re-raise on Warrior of Light just in case I don't want him to die for no reason and because we have the time I'm going to make sure that Light is with us is going to be up again for the next couple of turns and Explore Eileen you know same thing we're just going to go down here do all this damage and hopefully this turn we're going to be able to kill him he still buffs himself because we passed the second threshold which was 50% and there's one more threshold at 30% but I think this turn we're gonna see if we're able to kill it so we're gonna cast Alterna we're gonna do her move limit break then we're gonna cast Alterna see if we can get the kill with this hopefully we can nope it's okay obviously I forgot to use Lunara obviously they've Classic toasty moment. Forgot to use Lunara. Uh, if I would have used Lunara, I'm probably pretty sure I would have killed it. Doesn't matter. We're just gonna use the spell here, and we're gonna Karaja. Mistakes were made, but doesn't matter. We're gonna be able to kill it on the next turn. 
We're gonna do the same thing. We're gonna use pile driver finish and use uh, alterna to make sure that we can kill it. And that's gonna be it. Easy fight. Easy fight, especially when you have these characters. It makes it a little bit easier, right? Can we kill it? No, we still can't kill it. Wow. Man, I'm surprised. I thought we were gonna do a lot more damage than that. So, alright. Well, you know what? We're just gonna dual cast the spell and Karajo again. Man! This demon Chimera, I'm like, yeah, it's so easy to beat, and now at the end he just doesn't wanna die. That's what this fight is about. Uh huh. This is what it's about. So he stones everybody. Doesn't matter. Oh, actually, it does matter. Does it matter, actually? Do I have something to remove that? Do I have something to remove that? Hopefully I do. If I don't, then I'm in a lot of trouble right now. Uh, let's go down here. I think that that's good. Yeah, it is good. Of course, Prime Meal, just... CG Fina. Just make sure your old party never dies. That's what she's all about. Then here, we're gonna use Alterna. We're gonna make sure... Now we buff everything, because I want to make sure I can kill it. Boom, boom. And we're gonna kill it with magic, because Alterna, I told you guys, it takes forever to cast, and that's the best way to kill somebody with magic. Boom. Yay! We did it. We did it nice and easy. So, that's my party. Uh, if you guys used another party, please let me know down in, com in the comment section. Let me know what you guys use. If you do have Explorer Eileen, hopefully you guys are using her, because she is... She's amazing. Ever since she came out as a exclusive unit, guys, if you got your hands on her, just I told you, just use it. Use her, use her, use her. She's so good. And you guys can see, boom, we did it. Give me that 10% Moogle, because I need those ones. I need those bad boys. Guys, on that note, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please leave a like, subscribe for more. Uh, let me know in the comment section what team did you use or uh, what kind of TM or uh, what's your main team that you always use when you do those events, guys. So, thank you so much for watching, guys. I'll catch you guys next time. Peace!